not just Welcome back to Cruising as Crew. My name is Lucy, and today we are in Cagliari. Plan is to go to Flamingo Beach. Also, we're going to go for a Kinder Bueno croissant. So, we have just had crew drill on board, and now, as you can see, we are all just getting off and we're going to go to this little restaurant, well, cafe that I found a few weeks ago, and they have Kinder Bueno croissants. And I'm going to show you because it is just the best thing I've ever put in my mouth and coffee of course and then we're going to catch the bus to the beach because Cagliari is famous for flamingos and it is on this particular beach where we will find the flamingos so this is as you come out of the port and you just have to walk along here towards the town so just as you come out the port this is like the bus station so this is where we're going to catch the bus to Puerto Beach. Um, but first, we are going to go up the hill and get a Kinder Bueno croissant. All right, so you get to the top of the hill and then we are going to cross the road and go to the right. The place where we want to go is just here, incognito. Woo! Oh my god. So this is the Kinder Bueno croissant and this is the pistachio and the Kinder Bueno again. Oh my god. Wow. which were absolutely incredible and I would recommend anyone go there if you are on one of the cruises that goes to Cagliari. Um, so now we're just walking back down the hill to the bus station. Alright there Daniel. Uh, just vlogging your vlog. Just vlogging my vlog, oh okay. Do you want to be in it? So anyway this is Daniel, he works hey. with me and he is in menswear. What do you think of the croissant? It's delicious. Rate it, out of, rate it out of 10? The Kinder Bueno one is a 10 and the pistachio one is a 9. Two, you take two. You take two, I'll take two. And then when you get on a bus in Italy, you have to validate the ticket. So when the machines validate them, they, so these have been validated and then these haven't because there's no stamp. Amazing. The bus ride took about 15, 20 minutes ish. And then for the last like five minutes of the bus ride, you're basically going along the beach. You just have to decide where on the beach you want to get off. So I think we've got off where we can see flamingos, but I can't see any flamingos. So we'll just have to see. Love interrupted by tragedy Lost in the drought of... Just 
gone into a restaurant to get changed, to get my bikini on. So now I am ready to Sunday. Remedy, trying to find her place. insane and it's such a nice temperature as well and it's like this all the way out like even when you go up to your neck you can still see the bottom of the seabed so anyway I just had a little google of where the flamingos were because I thought they might be in like a different pe uh, a different area of the beach but I've missed them because they're actually only here in June in like the first week of June is when they come to this beach to lay their eggs or something like that. So, yeah, we've missed the flamingo. Much still abides, and I know she'd rather keep her distance. But as time moves on, she's drifting away, drifting away from me. But did the ocean? Everyone here are locals, and because it's far away from the port, there's like I haven't seen any cruise ship people here, which is like unheard of. So, yeah, 10 out of 10. So, you've got toilets there, showers there, and then that's the big Take my hand, no shame in the surrender. You ran to the west side. The yes. was stolen. All right, so we just got off the bus and it is half past three. And all aboard for crew is until five. And we know a really good pizza place down here. So I think hopefully the service is fast because usually they're a bit slow, but it's normally worth waiting because it's so good. Um, so yeah, we're going to get a pizza and then we'll get back on board. Right, so this is it. It's down here. And it's not this one. It's the next one. And it's like a little family run place. And oh my God, we had pizza two or three weeks ago here. And honestly, it's the best pizza I have ever had. and the pizza is six euros each um, and we all had like a glass of red wine with it so it was at 11 um, euros per person which is amazing um, but yeah it looks like it is going to rain now so we're gonna make our way to the ship but we've still got half an hour so we can just have a leisurely walk back um, yeah what a lovely day I'm sorry that I couldn't show you flamingos but in the bueno croissant the best beach that we've been to and the best pizza. Well, it looks like we are just going to miss the rain. It's raining! Look at that sky! Wow!
What the fuck? Watch, oh my god, what is this going down the side? Okay. Just about. It's all good. But I don't know if we will have to get ready for work just yet because I don't think we can leave. No, I don't. Because if the weather's like that, there's no way the ship can pull away from the side. Oh my god. What a. That is mad. Um, but I am on board, I am safe, and most importantly, all the passengers are on board and safe and i don't know whether we're going to leave now i don't know whether we're going to leave later because as i just said the ship cannot pull away while the weather's like that um but yeah so if everything goes to plan then i start working an hour so i'm going to have a shower definitely going to have a shower um even though i had one outside ha 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 uh, but anyway thanks for watching that was a bit crazy um yeah shit so i've got ready and just come for a coffee before work 
um, kind of expecting them to say like, oh, the ship's going to leave late because of the weather, but it's all stopped now. Look at that. Calm, absolutely fine. You would never know. Hey guys, so I just wanted to give you some updates now I've had the time to look at the footage, watch it back. So firstly, the guy who, it looks like he gets hit by the mattress that flies off the dock, but he doesn't. And you can see him literally a second after running round to help get the mattress inside. But he was absolutely fine and he was... Um, you know walking around the terminal afterwards helping people out so don't worry about him because when i initially watched that clip back i was like oh my god did i just not realize it at the time because i was scared that he got hit but he didn't get hit so he is fine all the passengers and sailors were fine like no one was injured it was just a little bit of an inconvenience because i don't know whether it comes across very well well it doesn't come across very well on the video but the terminal was literally shaking like the roof was a material roof so a lot of the noise that you could hear was the roof being blown about in the wind um, and then like the doors were going back and forth because the wind was so 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 strong and then I didn't catch it on film but at one point there was a bus full of people um, who hadn't come back as early as we had to get back on the ship but they were actually sat outside in the bus um, for like half an hour waiting to either come to the terminal or get on the ship um, but you could see the bus from the terminal was just rocking back and forth so I'm really glad that we were in the terminal and not on the bus because I think that would have been very scary having to sit there uh, on the bus while it was shaking back and forth for the storm um, but anyway the ship did leave on time because as you saw in the last clip when I showed you out the window of the mess it was like it had never happened calm seas calm seas blue skies like everything was absolutely fine so it was just a squall like it came and went really really fast but it was scary especially when things started flying off the dock and i'm really glad we left the restaurant when we did because i can imagine that table or that street of tables would have been blown about a bit because they didn't weigh anything but yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. It was a bit of adrenaline for the day. So you didn't see flamingos, but you did see a hellish storm. But thank you so much for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. And as always, if you have any suggestions, please leave them in the comments down below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.